As we prepare for the annual invasion of thousands of spring breakers to our coast, for one professor who now lives in Rivera, this time of year is a reminder of the brutal murder of his dear friend more than 30 years ago. It was back in 1989 when 21-year-old Mark Kilroy, a UT college student, was kidnapped and killed by narco Santanistas while spending spring break at the border. Our Bill Churchwell joins us now with that story. Tonight I spoke with the victim's friend who is recounting that shocking crime and sharing his warning all these years later. A warning, he says, still holds true for today's spring breakers. Wanting to become a medical doctor, that was his intent. Ryan Finley says next week will mark 33 years since his friend Mark Kilroy vanished during a spring break trip with a group of friends after crossing the border to Matamoros, Mexico. You know, as the story unfolded, if you remember, it just kept getting worse and worse and worse. The UT college student was kidnapped off the street, tortured, and sacrificed by members of a cult. His remains discovered the next month on a ranch along with other victims. Even in the southern region of Texas, they still talk about Mark's death every spring break. Finley tells me he was supposed to go on the trip, but changed his mind last minute, a decision that may have saved his life. Because I was so hot on going, so for me to all of a sudden have a change of heart, I uh, just think it was a protective angel over overlooking. Several books and even a movie have been based on the horrific crime. These are all the original posters of uh, Cameron County Sheriff's Department. Finley has kept newspaper clippings about the case and often speaks at churches and college campuses about what happened to his friend, all in hopes of sparking conversations about spring break safety. It's more relevant today than ever before. Be careful of the drug trafficking that's involved, human trafficking that's involved. It's just not a good, safe destination for fun. While Mexico is open to visitors, according to the U.S. Embassy in Mexico, there is a level three travel advisory because of COVID-19. And when it comes to crime, law enforcement has said it's always a good idea to use the buddy system and remain vigilant of your surroundings. All it takes is one time. Bill Churchwell, 3 News. Words of advice. Bill Churchwell, thank you a lot for that.